This video we're going to look at significant digits and multiplying and dividing. So um, with these numbers here, we've got one, two, three sig digs. Here we've got four sig digs. So when I'm doing this math, I take 46 times 52.00, 46 times 20, sorry. 46 times 20 gives me 920. This number has three sig digs, and this number has three sig digs. This one has four. I can only take the lesser number of sig digs, which in this case is what my calculator says anyhow, so it's nice and easy. But over here, I've got two sig digs, and then I've got four sig digs. So my answer can only have two sig digs. So if I take my 40 and then divide it by 52, my calculator gives me 0 0.76923 meters per second. Well, I only am allowed to have two significant digits because this number is my least specific number. And so what I'm going to get is this and this are my only sig digs. So my answer should actually be 0 0.77 meters per second. I can't give a number that's more certain than that because I only have two significant digits in my least accurate number. So I can't get less. So um, if you want to pause the video here, you can. I'm going to just quickly run through these calculations. So if you pause it and then want to check, you can. Okay, so for the first one, we've got 0.5 divided by 8. So my calculator is giving me 0 0.0625, and this will be kilometers per hour, but the kilometers is one sig dig, so this is gonna be 0 0.06 kilometers per hour. And the next I've got 0 0.0049 times 58.00, it gives me an answer of 0 0.2842, and this will be meters times seconds. But in this case, I only have two sig digs, and this is four, so my answer should be 0 0.28 meters times seconds. Here I've got 0.4 by 0 0.50, so 0 0.400 times 0.5 will give me 0 0.2. Now my calculator says 0 0.2, but you can see I've got two sig digs, so I need to have that value as well, because now I've got two sig digs in my answer. I've got 0 0.095 times 22.99. And in this case, my calculator gives me 2.18405, and this will be meters, because meters times seconds, you're going to count the seconds will cancel out. But I have two sig digs here, so this is going to be 2.2 meters. Here I've got 0 0.500 times 0 0.65 times 98. And I get, my calculator says it's 31.85. And in this case, it'll be grams that are my final unit. But you can see I've got two sig digs here. So my answer is actually going to be 32 grams. I can't have more sig digs than my least accurate number. And here I've got 0.8 divided by 5. So this is going to be 0 0.16 meters per second. But this is only one sig dig, so this is 0 0.2 meters per second.